not mm, this. I mm, mix. She's a runner. Oh no, she's oh. not a runner. What is up you guys and welcome to my channel and welcome to the sixth installment of the advent calendars for 2021. Today we are going to be doing the NYX Professional Makeup Gimme Superstar 24 Day Advent Calendar. So sorry if you heard that, I hit my microphone. Don't have a good place for it. If you guys are new here, my name is Jessie and we upload makeup unboxings and lifestyle videos. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little notification bell so you don't miss any of the future Advent Calendars unboxings or just any of my other uploads. This guy right here, it, uh, I paid $60 for it. But if you go on Ulta, it's $42 right now and you are supposed to get a retail value of $140 inside this 24 day advent calendar. So let's just kinda dive right on into this one. How is there? Thank you, okay. There is a little seal, so I'm gonna cut this one and not the actual box like my Macy's advent calendar. If at any point in time you guys are enjoying this video and you want to give it a thumbs up, that really does help me out and uh, you know, just, just it takes literally two seconds. Just give the video a thumbs up. Kind of had weird, to, this is, I like the star. I do like the star. <laughs> Day number one. My microphone's on, right? Because last time I did my elf one too, my microphone was not on. Day number one, we have a NYX butter gloss. This is in the shade Proline. Do we want to put it on our lips? I don't think we want to put it on our lips. I'm just going to swatch them on my hand. There's our first day lip gloss, whatever. It's a butter gloss, and this is the shade per Parline. Right, day number two, we have... Oh, so we do have a pressed pigment. I'm trying not to get my ring light in there. I probably have one of the biggest ring lights. And this is in the shade, I'm still holding this. And this is in the shade Soft Pink, Utopia Soft Pink. So there's our pressed pigment right there in the shade Utopia Soft Pink. That's pretty nice, um, although uh, pressed pigments say don't put it around your eyes. All right, day number three we have this is, and obviously everything's gonna be from NYX. You know, I did not that I was saying. Ever. Anyway, this is the HD Studio Photogenic Eyeshadow Base. Just a nude color for, obviously, your base of your eyeshadow. <laughs> and, and I don't know if I mentioned this, but it is 24 mini sizes. So not quite sample, but not quite the full size. And then day number four, the doors up here. This, oh, okay. Good thing I wasn't trying to save the box. Day number four, we have the Born to Glow Liquid Illuminator. My, I wanna just uh, assume like a liquid highlighter maybe. Ooh, little goes a long way, but that is the highlighter, the liquid highlighter that we have, and that is in the shade Sunbeam. On day number five, <laughs> We have another lip butter. Nope, we have a soft matte lip cream, and this is in the shade Leon. Ooh, that one's really pretty. I almost want to put this one on. I might put this one on. That is the shade Leon for the soft matte lip cream. What's kind of nice with the two colors that we did receive already from the lips, they're very, very similar. So if you want your matte lip cream to be glossy, you know, you kind of got a similar shade already. So that's cool. I do feel like a lot of the colors are going to be very similar. Just because it's kind of folly, Christmassy. You got like your, you know, your mauvies and your pinks and your browns and taupes. I almost forgot what colors were. I'm going to get lipstick everywhere. Day number six. Whoa. I can't get it. Oh, that one's really pretty. So this is the, oh, they're all called Utopias. Maybe that's just like, this is the shade Rose Gold in the pressed pigment. I have been looking for the perfect shimmery, rosy, gold, pinky, like just eyeshadow color. Eyeshadow. And I absolutely cannot find it. Out of my 200 and something palettes, I don't. I still can't find it, but that is the shade Rose Gold. Something similar to this that I'm kind of looking for, but this is not as, that was a terrible, that was still, we'll do that one. <laughs> Lucky number seven, NYX 
gave to me a, another butter glass. And this is in the shade Cinnamon Roll. It is kind of a it, brown color. Um, it's brown. <laughs> so there's our shade right there. Cinnamon Roll of the butter gloss. I will say I do appreciate the minis because I'm not one to really go through lip products quickly at all. Like, I, all right, so day number eight. There we go. We have, it fell out. We'll say, easiest one to get the products out of this box. All of the previous advent calendars. It's like fighting teeth, or fighting teeth, <laughs> like pulling teeth to get them out. Day number eight, we got another pressed pigment, but this is in the shade Brown Shimmer. A very unique name, very unique. It's really pretty though. So I swatched it right there, but it's just a very subtle, Hi, Rosie. What's up, boo-boo? Mom's recording a video. What's up? That was our shade Brown, brown Shimmer, which is just a, um, a fantastic name. It's lovely. Day number nine. We get to go all the way back to this side. Day number nine, we have another little butter gloss, and this is in the shade Fortune Cookie. This one is like a more nude color. Really nude. Like, I don't, can, can you see it? Can you see it? Anyway, so there's that one. Day number 10. Advent, what? That's, it says 81005-advent, 08-kissmy-dash, 2021 and then some like Chinese symbols. Confused. Anyway, door number 10. Maybe I spoke too soon about the product. Door number 10, we have a, another illuminating liquid illuminator. And this one, and this is in the shade Gleam. There is the shade Gleam or the liquid illuminator. Day number 11 is right here. Of course it's right next to 10. We do have another, I'm seeing a, a pattern here. You know, you're either going to get a lip, matte lipstick or liquid lip, a gloss, an illuminating liquid highlighter, or a pressed pigment. Anyway, this is in the shade Abu Dhabi. <laughs> this one's not swatching as nice as the other ones. It's, um, it's chunky. So up here, do you see the little chunks in it? <laughs> um, so that's your shade Ab Abu Dhabi. It's chunky. Abu Dhabi's chunky. <laughs> Day number 12, we have... Take your guesses, take your guesses, let's go with a pressed pigment. Ah, look at that, pressed pigment. Mm. But this is a, actually, is it like a foil? This might be it. Oh no, it's actually an eyeshadow. I was wrong, was wrong, it's technically an eyeshadow. This is in the shade gold. She is gold. Perfect for Christmas, like, I can imagine a really nice, like a bright gold eyeshadow. Like, hey, Billy. Why, why is everybody bothering me when I'm trying to record? I could just be sitting here doing absolutely nothing. Nobody comes in. Nobody says hi. Nobody bothers me. And now you're just going to purr loudly for my microphone. So day number 13, we have another soft matte lip cream. This is in the shade Monte Carlo. Interesting. It swatches really sheer. Do you see? It looks really, really dark in the container, but it's swatched pretty sheer. Like, I mean, it's still got some pigment and everything. All right, day number 14, let's liquid highlighter. Oh, close, the primer. This is the pore filler primer. I don't think I've ever tried the pore filler primer from NYX, so glad to have that. Day number 15, at least they broke the pattern right there. We have, ooh, the finishing powder. And I'm hoping it's, yeah, it is translucent. Day number 16. Please. Uh-oh. 
We're not gonna get 16, I don't think. There we go. All right, day number 16, we have a, another soft matte lip cream. This is in the shade Budapest. <laughs> this is more what I was expecting that red to kind of come out like, like, you know, more dark and pigmented. I like that color. Day number 17, we have a lip, another lip gloss or butter gloss. This is in the shade Tiramisu. Let me know down in the comments below. Do you like Tiramisu? Random question of the video. And there is our shade Tiramisu. Although, why is it pink? I, I would have made it like a brown color, like a chocolate or a coffee color. You know, I mean, literally, it's coffee. So I would have made it a brown color. Not pink. Even like a beige. I don't know. Oh, pink? For Tiramisu? Anywho, on day number 18, what are you? Oh, it's a lip oil. This is everything, and it's in the shade Sheer. That's a pink wand. What's the point of you? What? What's the... It's completely clear. It's a completely clear Sheer lip oil. Don't know how much use I'll actually get out of that. Because I'm I don't like glossy stuff. I really don't. So it's funny that I'm swatching all of these, but I'll just pass them on to my cousin or something. Open please. Thank you. Ooh! That's really pretty. Okay, I've really gotta give props to Nyx for their names. Here we have purple shimmer. Can we give the guy who names the shadows? A race. That is a really pretty color though. So there is our shade Purple Shimmer. <laughs> On day 20, we're getting close to the end. Give me something good, give me something different. Then we have another Butter Gloss, but this is in the shade Butterscotch. Looks very, very similar to, oh, maybe the cause caps are different but very similar to the cinnamon roll. Here's our shade Butterscotch. See, even the Butterscotch could have been Tiramisu. So that's cinnamon roll. It is completely different than the Butterscotch. They're just kinda in a very similar bottom two. On day number 21, we have another matte paint lip cream. Soft matte lip cream, not a paint. But this is in the shade Stockholm. It's a kid on a scooter. He's a little kid on a scooter. And she's a runner. Oh no, she's not a runner. I, <laughs> I think she was just trying to catch up to the kid on the scooter. Okay. Hopefully she's done. Alright, so day number 22, we have another shadow. If it's just called purple. Alright, so here's our next shadow for day number two. Take your guesses down in the comments below. What is the name of this shadow? It is dark purple. There's your shadow, dark purple. <laughs> now that is a really pretty, I can imagine if you put a little bit of that purple on your like crease and then you top it with the purple shimmer. <laughs> that would look really pretty for a nice, deep, purpley, smoky, you know, eye look. Day 23, so close to the end. That is a <laughs> dark purple, but the name is Copenhagen. Okay, there is the soft matte lip cream shade Copenhagen. I think that's how you say it. It's really hard to read because it's so dark, like, this writing almost needs to be white for this particular shade. Okay, moving on to the last day of the NYX Advent Calendar for 2021. Please be something good. Just another lip gloss, lip butter, butter gloss, lip gloss, butter. Again, another shade I would, I would gladly take it being called Tiramisu. But here we have the shade Brownie Dip. Alright, so... 
that is it for our 24 day NYX advent calendar for 2021. Uh, let me know your guys' thoughts and opinions on this one. I'm a little too much lip stuff for me in my personal opinion. I, not mm, this I, mm, NYX. To get over half of the products in your box to be something for your lips and it's not really advertised like as a majority lip product type of advent calendar okay that kind of just that really gets me that's kind of upsetting uh because if i wanted to get mostly lip stuff i would have got like an actual lip advent calendar you know what i mean oh to get 13 products for just being you know i mean it's a beauty advent calendar i'm not exactly happy with that but what i can say at least they didn't give us some like nail art face art a uh nail file or something <laughs> but they have i mean nyx has blushes on print bronzers right like you know some other face products even get a you know type of eyebrow I even know like that's kind of hard because you're not customizing your advent calendar just at all but to get 13 lip products I'm happy with the eyeshadows I am that that's pretty cool and to try their new primer that's great and also loving the liquid highlighters but again 13 lip products that's not um <laughs> that's what I get that's what I get. Okay, so I'm not trying to be, you know, like negative Nancy or anything, but again, I would have just preferred maybe seven at least lip products and then give me, you know, a few other cheek products or, I, you know, even a couple more uh, eyeshadows, like something that you can make like a full look because we only have two, didn't break, but we only have two matte colors. And you know the rest being shimmers I don't know I just feel like it was kind of not thought out properly for this advent calendar so let me know all your thoughts and opinions down in the comments below because I absolutely do love chatting with you guys if you did enjoy this video give it a thumbs up if you didn't go ahead give it a thumbs down either way you know what I want to know so that is going to be it for this I don't I always forget how to wrap up videos so uh, you know what? If you guys haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel by clicking this link right here. And if you missed any of the other previous advent calendars or you just want to binge watch some of my content and hang out a little bit longer, go ahead and click one of these links right here. I love you guys and I will catch you tomorrow for day number seven. Lucky number seven. Can anybody guess what that one's going to be? Bye! Am I in 4K? I think I'm in 4K.